Hi everyone! In this video, finally, I will going to show you how to make this hat. I made this one for my Turkish channel and everyone asked about it. Uh, and I want to make it uh, for this channel too. Uh, now I will use uh, this yarn, this worsted weight yarn and 5.5mm uh, crochet hook. And I made a part like that. I will show you the attachment uh, with that. And that's uh, versed weight yarn too. And I have so many hats uh, tutorial in my channel. Uh, you can see here the uh, beanie uh, playlist. Uh, and if you are ready, please uh, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And let's start. I prepare a part like that and I want to show you it's 18 inches from here to there and 10 inches long uh, it's so stretchy as you see you can measure it uh, by wrapping around it uh, your head. I start with a 46 chain uh, for make this. Now I will show you how to make uh, this one. As usual, I will start with a slip knot. And then chain uh, 46 just make the chain loosely I made the 46 chain then I will turn my chains like that you see this little bumps I'll always make my single crochets or double crochets from here now uh, skip that one chain and make a single crochet into that second chain and make nine more single crochet I made my ten uh, single crochet now I will make slip stitch I will just insert my hook from first stitch make a slip stitch and make four more I complete my five single crochet then I will make five half double one two three and five then I will make five slip stitch again one two three four and five Five half double one more time we will make five slip stitches one, two, three four and five and then five half double crochet two three four five 
and for the top of uh, our head we will make five slip stitches again one two three four and five now i want to show you what we made this far we will start with 46 chain by the way i will make this uh, for an adult uh, if you want to make it for a child uh, just change uh, your crochet hook and your yarn use a uh, um, softer yarn uh, maybe a uh, three or if uh, you are making this for a baby a uh, yarn size two is enough for you and uh, use a different crochet hook uh, you will not have to change uh, the uh, stitch you have as you see it's almost the same with the same crochet hook and same size yarn uh, I made 10 uh, single crochet 5 slip stitches 5 half double crochet 5 slip stitches 5 half double crochets, 5 slip stitches, 5 half double crochet and for the last time we will make 5 slip stitches. We will always make 5 slip stitches here and 10 half double crochet here. We will always make these parts like that. Uh, we will make this part for 2 row. This is row 1 and for row 2 we will make like that. Then uh, for uh, two rows, we will just switch uh, this two part. Now I will show you. Now for the second row, just chain one and turn your work. Now we will make slip stitches here, but uh, we will make them back loop only. This is first uh, chain just skip this one and make a back loop only slip stitch here and make four more two three four and five slip stitches then make uh, we have half doubles here as you see make five half double one two three four and five uh, we will always uh, use back loop only okay for all the beanie we will always use back loop only now we will make five back loop only slip stitches one, two, three, four, and five. Five back loop only half double crochet. Five slip stitches. Five half double crochet, and for the last time, we will make five slip stitches again. One, two, three, four and five we will have 
10 uh, single crochet here for the brim and we will make 10 again uh, <laughs> if I can save my yarn yes 10 back loop only single crochet nine and ten just chain one turn your work and make ten back loop only single crochet again now this is our front side uh, maybe you can uh, use something like that for uh, not uh, confuse about it for the first two rows uh, we made slip stitches here half double crochets here and keep doing like that now we will start with half double crochet and then slip stitches We will make five back loop only half double crochet one two three four five then five slip stitches Five back loop only half double crochet. Five back loop only slip stitch. And I will make this one more time. Two, three, four, and five. Then I will make five slip stitches here, then five slip stitches here, totally ten. I will complete this. And that's 10. Chain 1, turn. Now again we will make 10 back loop only slip stitch. And we have half double crochet here. Make five half double. We will keep doing like that and make five uh, slip stitches, five half double. Five slip stitches, five half double. Just complete this part. I will see you here. I came here and then I will make 10 uh, back loop only single crochet. I complete it, chain one and turn. Then make 10 uh, single crochet again. I made the row 5 
and then I will switch this uh, two stitches again. I will start with five slip stitch. And make five half double crochet, back loop only half double crochet. I will just keep doing like that. When you came uh, at the right side of uh, your work, you will switch this uh, two stitch. When you are at the uh, wrong side of your work, you will uh, repeat the uh, last row you made. Okay? Just keep doing like that. And um, I didn't count my uh, rows here. Uh, but you can uh, measure it like I show you before. We start uh, to make our chains from here and I finish here. That's the only important thing and one more thing is important. Here, as you see, we start with five slip stitch and five half double crochet and I finish with five half double crochet, five slip stitch here. So uh, it will match good like that, like Legos. <laughs> it will match like that. Now we will uh, join these two parts together. I fold these two parts together like that and I'm at the wrong side of my work. Uh, this is uh, the upper and that one is the back. Okay. I will just insert my hook from the first chain. I take both loops. And then from that first stitch, I just take back loop and take this yarn from here and pull it through from the stitches. I just chain one for the skewer. Take both loops from here. Take only back loop here. And slip stitch. Both loop. Back loop. Make a slip stitch. Keep doing like that and uh, join this two part together. I complete the joining and cut my yarn, take a yarn needle now we will sew this part I'll make it like that, just insert your um, needle from here and here I will take this once like that. And so it. And that's finish. And that's finish. I hope you like this. Uh, this is the joining part. As you see, you can't see even if you uh, look like that. I made the wrong joining here. You see? 
<laughs> it looked bad, really, really bad. But uh, I like this, uh, and I use this every time almost. Uh, and this one is for my husband. I hope he like to use this one too. Uh, I then made a pom pom. Uh, if you want, you can make and use uh, like that. Uh, and it's uh, maybe look a little complicated, but it's really not. And I hope you like this pin it too. And please leave comments about this one too. Uh, Sris Crochet uh, is my Instagram address. You can always reach me uh, from there. Uh, and thanks for watching me. Uh, hope to see you again.